The following portion of the Arizona Daily Mix is sponsored by Dignity Health. April is Donate Life Month, and joining me is Angie Smith, a Domino Transplant Manager, to tell us about the organ donations and how important it is, especially right now, and how are you doing? I'm well. Thank you for having me. Okay, okay let's talk about this month, about, of course, Donate Life. What does that mean? Yeah. So April is Donate Life Month, and it is an opportunity for us to bring awareness to organ donation um, and to honor all the donors uh, that support you know, transplants across the country. And right now it's very important because you're going to give us some numbers here yeah. about transplants and how, again, they're kind of numbers that are down that we need more of, right? Correct. There's over 100,000 people. Um, on waiting lists across the country for all organs and we have patients that you know die while waiting for a, a transplant and so uh, organ donation whether it be you know living donation or donation at the time of death is incredibly important to support that work. Yeah okay let's talk about how people actually come from around the world mm -hmm. to Phoenix because of the program that you have there at the St. Joseph Hospital, which is amazing, isn't it? Yeah, it's incredible. So Norton Thoracic Institute, so since the inception of the Transplant Center back in 2007, we've done close to uh, 1,800 transplants across uh, lung, liver, and kidney, um, along with our living donation program. So all of that work is supported through organ donation. Yeah. You did something to kick this month off, we which did. was really uh, amazing to see. Yeah. So on Friday, in honor of our transplant recipients and those organ donors and their families, we were able to plant um, this over 1,700 pinwheels in the front of our hospital in recognition and acknowledgement of that, that work and, and those donors and recipients. Um, this is a community, because once you donate, you become a big family, mm -hmm. um, and you have support out there. And that's what you mm -hmm. want people to understand, too, is that it's not just donating an organ, you are actually donating life, um, and you got the support from other people and from your program Correct. to make sure they're doing it, of course, not alone. Yeah, absolutely. There's a huge community out there. There's a big community of living donors that have donated kidneys, part of their livers, um, that support each other, and um, the transplant programs across the country You know, uh, do their best to support organ donors and their family and honor that gift. Yeah. Okay, you've been talking about living donors. Correct. Explain that a little bit. Yeah, so um, people that are interested in helping somebody who may need a kidney, um, we can do, uh, we can take somebody's kidney while they're still alive and use that in a kidney transplant. Um, it's incredibly helpful because the need for kidney transplant is higher than, um, than we can meet with deceased donors. And so living donors, that offers an opportunity for transplants earlier, sometimes even before they go on dialysis. So it's an incredible gift. Yeah. And the technology and the medicine has changed so much over the yes. years where you guys are on the cutting edge, you're on there to make sure. And that's important, isn't it, this time? It is. It is. It's uh, important to make sure that we're caring for our living donors, uh, making sure we're keeping them safe through the donation process, and then also making sure that we're successful with those transplants. Okay. Donating. How can people donate? Yeah. So a couple different ways. So if uh, you can go to donatelife.org and you can register to become a uh, organ donor. Um, anytime you access the Department of Motor Vehicles, they'll ask you. You can do it that way as well. Um, and uh, if you do some research out there, there's some other uh, web pages where you can inquire about living donation. Yeah, and you always recommend people to sit down with the family and talk about this because um, you're, again, going to be saving someone's life and they need to know too about that and that's yeah. something that you definitely when they come to talk with you you yes. you go through some things to make sure yeah absolutely it's incredibly important i think anybody who's interested in being a uh, organ donor um, either you know uh, via either way it's really important just to have those discussions with your family so they can support that process yeah. as well well this is amazing and i know it just uh, we're just saying for april but donating organs all year are very important to us Correct. and so this is a time that we bring it to the forefront yeah Information's right there on the bottom of your screen, how you can find out more about uh, the program and, of course, how to be an organ donor. So thank you, thank you for coming in. Yeah, so of thank you. The preceding portion of the Arizona Daily Mix was sponsored by Dignity Health.